Hey guys, Google has finally started rolling out the new Android TV interface for the home screen. Here I have the OnePlus TV Q1 Pro and I got this new interface just yesterday. It is easy to be confused as Google TV but it's not. It's just a UI of the Android TV launcher. Google TV is slightly different than this. You can check the video I made long back about the Google TV UI. I will leave a link to that video in the card above. The update is pushed through Android TV Home app, especially this version. But if you don't see the new UI, even after being on the same version, don't worry. You should be getting it soon. Now coming to the interface, as soon as the interface is changed, it will give a small notification, clicking on which it takes you to a walkthrough of features and services from which you would want recommendations. Unfortunately, right now it supports only these four apps and YouTube for India. Hope to see more apps like Sony Live, Z5, Woot, etc. in the future. On the main screen, we have three tabs now. Home, Discover and Apps along with the Google search. Below the Home tab, we have the header or so-called ads for showing some trending content from the four apps that it supports. It would keep auto-scrolling with four to five recommendations. They even expand if the selection is brought onto it. Next, we have the favorite apps row, similar to the one we have seen in the previous UI. We can add our favorite apps to the list for quick access. We can also move to change the order. Next, we have the Play Next, which shows our history from Hotstar or Apple TV. Then we have Netflix recommendations, followed by YouTube, Play Movies, Oxygen Play, etc. These are all very similar to the previous UI, except that there's no app icon on the left and the new rows look more condensed and clean. The customized channels option is also very similar to the previous UI. We can select and unselect particular apps row to be showed or removed from the main screen. The manual reorder option for the rows is also present. Coming to the next tab, Discover. This is the new section that has a lot of potential if used well by Google. Here we will be able to see content recommendations from Hotstar, Prime Video, Apple TV MX Player and YouTube at present. The header section will have 4 to 5 recommendations. Then we have top picks for you. This would be I guess based on our watch history, Google search history or watch list. Now this is where the disappointment starts and shows how half cooked this is. Just see the thumbnails. They are not at all consistent and none of this can generate any interest to watch the content. They should have at least pushed with proper thumbnails. But good thing we can see the apps it's available in, the genre and the runtime. Also if you want to improve the recommendations you can use this option to like and dislike the content recommendations. Then we have the watch list. These are the movies that I added to my Google's account watch list from Chrome browser. But we can also add to watch list from here by long pressing OK on any title. Then there's more rows for recommending different genres of content like action shows, thrillers, trending on Google, crime mysteries, adventure fantasies. At the bottom, we can again change the apps from which we want recommendations. Also, when we tap on any title, we get this new page with more info about the movie or the show with quick access to trailer, apps where to watch it, watch list, and also the cast involved.
movie content rating and rotten tomato score at the top to decide if you want to take the risk or not to watch it the last tab is the apps or we can say the app drawer itself if you long press the home the tab will automatically switch to apps here all the apps that are downloaded on the tv would be listed out along with the option to open play store it's just a full screen app drawer section and nothing else The settings, UI and everything on the TV remain the same. Nothing else changes. Even the Android version is not changed. So do remember that this is not Android 10 or 11. This TV is on Android TV 9. So that's a brief overview of the new Android TV UI. The home and app section are very functionally similar to the previous Android TV interface. But the discover section is a new addition which is basically very similar to oxygen play or patch wall we are familiar with where we are provided with recommendations from different ott apps i really hope to see it refined with better thumbnails and recommendations so that's all in this video if you got this interface let me know your favorite feature in this and if you did not don't worry just hold on a little longer